Have you ever wanted to add both ultraviolet and deep red light to a grow? I know I have. Welcome to the Hippie Geeks. Let's take a look at the Spider Farmer UV-30 and IR-16 kit and see if we can fit them into the tent. I somehow managed to not hit the record button on the camera when I was unboxing both of these units, which has not happened in quite a while, but as you only get one chance to unbox a unit, I kind of messed up on that one. However, the packaging on these units has been very similar, and I am actually going to throw some footage from our recent review of the R40 unit that we just checked out as it uses nearly the identical packaging. Each box is going to come with two light bars and a power cord. They are using the same excellent packaging that should get them delivered safely to your house, though they are a little bit of a pain to get out of the foam. Once again, you will need to pull the wires all of the way through the foam holders to get them out. Once you have that done though, they are ready to get hooked up. The lights are going to use the exact same connectors that we have seen in the rest of their supplemental lighting, which means that you can mix and match strings of lights together if you want to, though I would not really recommend that. You will actually want to have these different lights on different timers, as each set has a different recommendation for when it should be used and for how long. We will cover that more in a bit of a later video though, once we get them hung up in the tent itself. First though, I am going to string them all together out here just to see what kind of power all four of them are going to pull from the wall, and it is actually a little hard to see how much light they are going to put out, but you can tell that they are on. I plugged the entire strand of lights into one of our portable power banks, and then checked the power draw which ended up being right at 42 watts, which wasn't bad at all. These lights also shouldn't be on all the time, so really will not draw much power at all throughout a grow. Each of the light bars comes with a pair of ratcheting straps, and I used all of them to hang each of the light bars in the tent. I am pushing them to the edges of the tent so that I can hang the main grow light in the center, and you can see that I have actually had to remove the exhaust fan from the inside of the tent entirely. It is just too crowded in here to have that as well, though it is fine and I will just end up putting it on top of the tent like we have done many times in the past. We will have a video coming out soon showing how we are going to have the tent set up to finish flowering out the plant that we have going right now, so keep an eye out for that one if it is something that you are interested in seeing. When you go to actually use these lights, Spider Farmer recommends that you use the UV light bars for the last three weeks of flowering, up to two hours per day. That is going to help boost THC and CBD levels, enhance yield, and elevate the flavor profiles. With the deep red light bars, they recommend using that for 15 minutes before the main grow light switch is on, and then another 15 minutes after the main light switch is off. That is going to help with stem strength, starting flower production, and inducing sleep in the plant. I am really curious to see how this plant does under these lights, and we will definitely be talking more about them as time goes on. I am not sure how exactly I want to mount everything, but will likely be trying a couple of different locations over time. I am also definitely going to be using one of our smart power strips to control everything, just to make sure that the lights are on when they are supposed to be, and then also off when that is appropriate as well. A big thank you to Spider Farmer for sending over these supplemental lights, and if you want to check out these units or any of their other gear for yourself, make sure to click on the links to their website in the video description down below, and use the discount code GEEKS at checkout to get 8% off your entire order.